Congratulations. Behold, the Smithsonite Discloisite. The Burgalka's mine, Groot Fontaine District, a Jotsun Zupa region, Namibia. Bean and cheese. I get so mad when I hear things scuttling inside the walls. Like, yeah, we get it. You're a creature. You don't need to rub it in my face that you're capable of scuttling. My favorite dynamic in both platonic and romantic ships are... We share the brain cell. Or, they are both very smart until you put them together and then they're dumbasses. My brain cells allergic to yours is peak dynamic. One time in third grade I zoned out, and I don't think I ever zoned back in. Help me. When you can sense a mood incoming and feel like a farmer standing in a field looking out at the horizon as the storm approaches like, Mmm, looks like it's gonna be a bad one, boys. Have you ever wondered how many fictional characters you've absorbed into your personality? <laughs> Who am I? Some girls are made with sugar, spice, and everything nice. Ugh. They're made with garlic, basil, and olive oil. Mmm, garlic bread. How about you date a girl who is a home and an adventure all at once? Or date a girl who doubles as a haunted house! Why is it that bullies can always tell you're LGBT or like neurotypical way before you can? The new diagnostic tool, a middle schooler. Sometimes I get so jealous of other people's skills, like, damn, like they can talk to people and people like them? Like, look at all those people who like them! What the fuck? Silico. No offense, but if you just straight up drink milk, then I will never listen to a word you say to me. Well, next time you fall from a tree, we'll see who's laughing. My bones are thick like Mr. Incredible. You wish you were me. Dungeons and Dragons is such a powerful game. It can make a six foot three inch man blush like a cherry when he pretends to kiss his wife's pretend character. Dude, he was 15 shades of red asking to pretend to kiss his wife's pretend character. This man has dated, married, and fathered a child with this woman, and yet he's like, well, what if we kissed Helen <laughs> Hands? Introducing Dr. Brian Fisher, California Academy of Sciences. Dr. Fisher, get off that man's face. You're a scientist, now act like one. It's time. No, 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 it's not time. It's fucking March. I don't want to see this. It's time. <laughs> Posture checklist. Don't hunch or your spine will bunch. Stand up, arms up, lift up. Love your back to prevent ow her back. <sighs> Much better. Today I learned that B.F. Skinner, a famous psychologist, instilled superstitions in pigeons by giving them food in a cage at set time intervals. The pigeons responded by performing rituals, which they believed brought them the food, such as bobbing their heads or turning counterclockwise. Pigeon. Religion. I was the fastest liquid on earth. <laughs> Milk. It's pasteurized before you see it. <laughs> Me opening my own story. Huh. I wonder if the author has updated it yet. This is the writing equivalent of checking the fridge, walking away, and coming back to see if it spawned a better snack while you weren't looking. Y yeah. I'm not so hard because Artemis is the Greek goddess of, among other things, maidenhood and archery. She's literally an arrow ace. <laughs> arrow ace. You son of a bitch. I will never know peace again. Clams can move. Clams can move. I never would have thought those things could move. I thought they just vibed. Oh yeah, they can also swim. They can what? Fog and mist are my favorite kind of weather. It's just our atmosphere. I can imagine seeing a hillside generally coming in and out of the fog, making it look like a floating island in the distance. Perfect. Beautiful. Walk out of the fog and announce what millennia you're from. Start appearing mysteriously and just enjoy the cool moods that flow around. Man, this person's out here really making me like fog. If I'm being subjective, the greatest sci-fi show of all time is Doctor Who. If I'm being objective, it's Doctor Whom.
<laughs> doctor, I think I'm going deaf. The doctor said, well, describe the symptoms. Well, Homer's bald and Marge's blue hair. All right, Sans is a Homestuck character. The confidence this exudes scares me. Good. That's how you know it's the truth. Accept it. My best feature is that I'm blindingly intelligent for about 30 seconds a day. And I don't get to choose which seconds. They're not consecutive. The sun is on fire, I repeat, the sun is on fire! The ocean is flooding, I repeat, the ocean is flooding! This is an emergency, guys! The Earth is spinning, guys! The fucking spinning! A mysterious gas has settled all throughout Earth and we're currently bringing it in! Brought to you by Fox News. Just overheard a little girl ask her father if I'm a boy or a girl and all he said was, Well, some people have bodies. Mmm, assigned corporeal at birth. We learn that Splatsville is located in a broader region called the Splatlands. It seems the intense sun and harsh environment have had a profound effect on its inhabitants. In the recent years, trend-setting inklings have been drawn to the culture like moths to a Bunsen burner. I like the implication that a bunch of teens have moved to a desert wasteland for, like, the clout. <clears throat> Coachella. Wait, I just realized my mom gave me my new stuff for my key ring the day after she complained that I kept accidentally sneaking up on her because I don't realize how quiet I am. My mother belled me like a cat I didn't even realize. Oh, <laughs> cat boy. Everyone is so mean to me all the time. Mmm, soup with tomatoes and soup with noodles. Those are a pair of my favorite foodles. The New York Triber, New York, August 3rd, 1921. Uh, the spirit of the internet existed long before it had an electronic vessel to inhabit. Oh, I get it. It's ICUP. What is? Nothing. Go back to bed. Sometimes YouTube comments are complete garbage. And then there are comments like this. Great workout music for my pet snails. Thanks. Aw, oh, Dave McCracken, bless your heart. Truth or dare? Uh, I, I dare you to... Uh... F fall in love with me. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm just, I'm just kidding, bro. I'm just, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Unless I looked everywhere for this. <laughs> no way! How did they? <laughs> what? But she? <laughs> the whole barbecue sauce bottle? <laughs> That's crazy. Humans are weird. <laughs> Wait. How did you know this story? Why didn't you invite me? Oh, that makes sense. You are so wise beyond your years, great. Oh, you're so cute. I just saw the words cat boy, cat girl, and neon binary, and it took several years off my life expectancy. <laughs> it's probably one of my posties. Can men and women really just be friends? Straight people are so weird. It is a fact that bisexuals can make friends. There is only prey. <laughs> so I got kicked out of a Taco Bell for bringing in a Bluetooth speaker in the bathroom. I didn't even start playing Sabaton the Last Battalion before I was dragged out. I will now wage war elsewhere. I'm sorry, what? Oh, police. <laughs> I accidentally stepped on my cat's foot and need to be arrested. Take me away, please. I wonder if Vader ever found out that the droid who carried the Death Star plans was R2. I could just imagine him thinking, Well, this explains everything. My men didn't stand a chance. You fools. You absolute incompetent fools. What was the droid? It was the blue R2 unit. Oh, <laughs> that's my boy. Subject, my cat. Symptoms, small, make small noises, small brain, stupid. Diagnosis, baby. Course of action. A kiss on the head. Sparkling water is disappointing because you smell it and it's like, mmm, super fruity. And then you taste it and it's just angry water. So I found out people have strong feelings about sparkling water. I too share the sentiment of this post. Sparkling water needs to chill and stop trying to bite the inside of my mouth. It's rude and unpleasant and I don't like it. Do you ever get bored on the internet and then grab your phone to see what the other smaller internet is up to? I love dogs who are obsessed with licking people. <gasps> this human is pleasing to me. I have to put my tongue on it. Well, dogs treat us like we treat cool rocks. Your relationship to rocks is apparently very different than mine. I am a simple woman. I enter the kitchen. I eat four servings of bread products. And then I leave. It's one serving if you serve it all to yourself at once. I like the way you think, friend. No, oh, he looks so tired. Let him nap. 
he looks like more butter toast. You know, it's really funny how many people on here make jokes about anti-vaxxers and flat earthers, but then they practice astrology at the same time, even though it's literally the same as pseudoscientific bullshit. <laughs> Looking up your horoscope doesn't give kids polio. I still don't know how to spell spaghetti without autocorrect. Hey, Bucky, where's the H? An H? A lumberjack went into a magic forest to cut a tree. Upon arrival, he started to swing at the tree and it shouted, Wait, I'm a talking tree! And the lumberjack smiled and said, And you will die a log. <laughs> do werewolves have toe beans? Of course they have toe beans. What else do you suck on? If there is a god, mine is surely a trickster, giving me the miracle of sight and of comprehension. Only for me to be cursed to use it on what you just said. You know what? Mayhaps the villains deserve to destroy this society. After that last post, I agree. Guess who's got two thumbs and... This guy. Two, two, two thumbs and what? This guy. Call out posts at all writers. Right. No. By the way, I know everything, but don't ask me any questions because I don't like it. Ah, me with my characters. Mm-hmm. I now understand why old people sit outside just to sit outside. Uh, I remember when you turned 24. Ah, oh, what a time to be alive during Tumblr's edgy phase. Wait, how old is Tumblr? About 14 years. Mmm, seems about right. You know when your video game spouse says I love you and calls you dear and you tear up a little because you realize you're starved for romantic affection? This wasn't supposed to be a relatable meme, y'all good? People are tagging all their video game lovers and crying. Yeah. I eat 15 apples for breakfast, then drive myself to the hospital just to watch the doctors get blasted backward into the drywall because they cannot withstand my aura. So, you are what people in math problems are actually doing. Woman? Oh, no. You misheard. I'm an omen. I don't identify as male or female. I identify as a warning. Congratulations! It's a harbinger. Oh, majestic grape of the hand, what is your wisdom? Looking at you infuriates me. There's no punchline, I hate mittens. Behold, the acts of war crimes. We finally did it! And you promised me a wedding when we return home! I did. Let's go. Our next question is, what do rich people eat? Eat? L like a poor? Phoenix, nutrients now! <laughs> what did you say you do again? I'm a games journalist. Dude, gross. <sighs> hmm. Oh shit, whoops, I killed Krillin! You're not mad at me, are you? No, no, it's okay. Uh, are you sure you're not mad? <laughs> Welcome to the stupid hut. Well, what's inside? Something stupid. Uh, okay. Man. Hey, can you tell me something wholesome? Listen, you fuck, there's nothing left. Eat what you got to, take up what hobby you need to. The current mission objective is survive. We gonna make it? Yeah, maybe. We gonna be happy? No. This is a very big chungus 100% wholesome hugs. If you ever speak Reddit to me again, I'll kill you. Okay, here's your COVID shot. Oh, shit. Sorry, wrong shot. I got the fix right here. Mmm! Mmm-mm! Captain Rich, what will we do? Reddit is crashing the market! Hmm... Destroy the rich! Put all of your money into GameStop! Die! You never lose by playing both sides. <laughs> Sir, it's us, the internet police. We're taking you in. You posted a photo of a dog that looked just slightly sad. That doesn't even make any sense. The internet police isn't real. Oh, we're real. And we are pissed. I'm sorry, sir. Your card's been declined. Then I would like to apply for your store's credit card. Uh, okay. Infinite unending money! You know what? The Earth is flat. And I'm going to find the ice walls. Well, here it is. This endeavor has not changed anything in my life. Okay, you get one beach episode. <laughs> oh no, a 
Yes, my breeze! Mm -hmm, not for that shit. 